guys, so today's video is essentially just a PR makeup haul, but it's a very special one. So everything is from Mecca and it's all limited edition product, which has been made in collaboration with some of their favorite brands to celebrate their 20th birthday. So if you guys don't know what Mecca is, Mecca is Australian and New Zealand sort of high-end cosmetic retailer. So Mecca has now been in Australia obviously for 20 years, so they are celebrating in a big way, which is super exciting. So we've only had Sephora in Australia for like nearly two years. So a lot of the brands you could commonly find in Sephora in the US aren't actually stocked in our Sephoras. They're stocked at Mecca. So they have brands like Hourglass, Urban Decay, NARS, Too Faced. So if you're not in Australia or New Zealand, unfortunately, Mecca do not ship internationally. However, if there is anything you desperately want, you could use a forwarding service like Shop and Box and they'd be able to get it for you, package it up and forward it to you. So if there's anything you still really, really want, you can get it. You'll just have to use a forwarding service and I'll link shop and box below So if you guys have never heard of them or use them before you can check them out But without further ado, I'm going to jump straight into showing you what's in these amazingly bright colored boxes And yeah, it's just gonna be a very casual video today, too I am I'm in a bit of a funny mood like I, I want to film but I also don't want to film I have a really sore eye too. my right eye is getting quite red and it feels really irritated so if I look down from the camera a lot, I'm sorry, I know that's annoying, but I can't handle looking at the lights when my eyes are feeling irritated. And if you guys are new faces and you didn't know, I suffer with a lot of eye problems, I have a genetic eye disease, it's amazing, it's things that are all out of my control that I can't help with, just how I was born, but we persevere, we get through it, I'm just letting you know, because people like to point out things to do with my eyes all the time, and it's just like, yeah, I know. I uh, know. So anyway, without further ado, let's actually jump straight into it. Now, all of these products are going to be available from Mecca as of October 4. So Mecca is a fellow Libra. My birthday is October 2nd. So no wonder I vibe with them so much because we're both Libras. So we're like sisters pretty much. My number one favorite thing that they have collaborated on is the Mecca and Hourglass um, Ambient Lighting Palette. And oh, I used it today. I have the bronzer on my face and I also have the blush. So we have three powders, obviously. We have the finishing powder in Luminous Light, which is this one. We then have in the middle a blush and it's called the Mecca Birthday Glow. So this is a limited edition blush color that they've made just for this palette, which is so exciting. And then they have Luminous Bronze Light, which I believe is an existing bronzer. So this one... I believe retails for 100 Australian dollars or 109 New Zealand dollars. So next up I got the Kevin Aquan The Making Faces Beauty Book. This is so pretty. So I don't own any Kevin Aquan. This is my first ever Kevin Aquan, which I think I'm saying that right. First ever product from their range and it is so cool. So when you take the little slip off, that is what it looks like. And it's like a, a little book of mini palettes. So it comes with a little booklet on how to use everything. And then this is what it looks like. And then you just open it up, it's magnetized. And then it has a mirror, as you can see, my mess. And then you've got all the little books on the inside. But the first one is chapter one, contour, and these shades. These shades look so good. I cannot wait to get that on my face. So then you have the chapter two, which is for lush and define. And obviously it's pretty self-explanatory. Has some blushes in it, but it also has some eyeshadows so that you can define your eyes. And then lastly, it is the emphasize the eyes little palette. And this is like just all eyeshadows. So as you can see, same sort of packaging again on the outside. Then when you open it up, you have all the eyeshadows in there. So just lots of like nice neutral shades with that little pop of blue color, which is really pretty. And that's a shimmer as well, the blue. And that one retails for 110 Australian dollars or 119 New Zealand dollars. And then next up, we have some really cute goodies in here. We have a little stealer set and it has a liquid lipstick, a liquid liner and a mascara. I tried the mascara and liner today. I do really like the liner. I felt it did kind of like um, 
bleed a little bit in the very inner corners of my eyes where I'm like super wrinkly in there. But other than that, I really liked it. It has a really great defined tip. So it says it's got the full size stay all day waterproof liquid liner, which yeah, it is full size. It's in intense black. It has a liquid lipstick in a limited edition shade called Mecca, which is a warm rose. And then it has a extreme lash mascara, which is a deluxe size sample. So this is the liquid lipstick. I love Love the color of this this looks really really pretty so that is it swatched obviously it looks quite dark on my hand because I'm so pale right now I always find when I'm really pale the colors swatch like so much darker but the mascara is really really nice I actually really like this I tried this this morning for the first time and I really like the wand it's quite a large wand and it has like lots of little spikes but I like the very end of it because I found I could use that to get in around my lower lash line really easily and it's very black and it definitely like looks good on my lashes and then the Stila, um actual liquid eyeliner that's it there it has a beautiful tip I definitely like it I just wish it wouldn't bleed like that in my inner corners but I find lots of liquid eyeliners do that which is why I typically wear pencils because it's just like it's going to happen and when you like put the lid back on it must push the tip into something or like push the tip up because you can feel like a, a resistance when you're putting the lid on. But then when you pull it back off, it's like perfectly fine. Like the tip is all A-OK. -okay. So it must be how it sort of like pumps the product through the tip. I don't know. I could be just talking rubbish, but I feel like there's a reason why it feels like that. <laughs> so that little set retails for 67 Australian dollars or 73 New Zealand dollars. And they're also selling the full size of this liquid lipstick. And it is $32 full size Australian dollars or $35 New Zealand dollars. So, yeah, so you can buy that separate if you don't want the mascara and liner. But I actually kind of like this little set. I think it's really cute. So next up I have... This velvet lip glide set from NARS. Check out how beautiful the packaging is. It's like that metallic silver and it has the Mecca peachy color. You get six velvet lip glide products in it. So I tried one of these this morning and I really, really like them. They're a beautiful creamy formula. I'll swatch all of these for you. So let me just get them out. I love the packaging of NARS products and I like the fact these are minis too. I just feel like these are such good sizes. Like check out those sizes. How good are they? Because I like will never use a full size lipstick, especially like a liquid lipstick. Even though these don't dry matte, they're velvet so they stay creamy on your lips. But I think that's a really good size to purchase these sort of products in. So I would definitely recommend if you haven't tried out their velvet lip glides and you want to, I would get this set because it is so cute and the little bag it comes in is this freaking adorable. Let me quickly tell you how much it is before I start swatching. It is 82 Australian dollars or 89 New Zealand dollars. So I think that's pretty amazing for like all six of those shades and there's a great variation in color as you can see you've got like your pinky purplies nudie sort of shades and some reds and some more neutral nudes so let me like quickly swatch all the shades i'll just take this stealer one off my hand first i never do swatches in my videos guys because they're so messy but you keep saying you want swatches in the haul so i'm doing my best to give you guys what you want so i hope you appreciate my effort i'm trying my hardest to do it i just sometimes i just don't have enough time and they're very time consuming and messy so when i don't do them it's just because i didn't have enough time so i'm sorry but i'll try my best to start doing them so this first shade is called immortal and this is what i tried this morning and it's beautiful it's like a gorgeous sort of purpley mauve sort of color i guess you could describe it as so i'm only doing small swatches because the smaller swatch the easier it is to clean and the less mess i make so i hope that is okay with you guys so this next shade is called Rapture and this is what I would consider looking at in the tube like a pinky sort of nudie shade. It kind of has like rosy undertones but definitely has like pinky vibes and nudie vibes all at the same time. So that is it there, the second one over. As you can see, cute, love that color. Next one is Night Together and this is more of like a like brownie nude is how I would describe it, more of a natural nude shade. And also just ignore 
how patchy my swatches look on my hand. I can't help it. I just have hairy hands, which I know, I don't know, is that weird? Do you guys have hairy hands? The back of my hand's literally so hairy. So when I do swatches, the product always like sticks in my hand hair. Um, oh, what did I just drop? That was my phone, shit. Anyway, that's that swatch there. Then I have the shade Californication. And it is like, kind of reminds me of a nail polish. It's sort of like a mauve a darker mauve shade. Mauve-y. Mauve-y. Mauve How do you guys say it? Mauve or mauve? Anyway. <laughs> so that's that shade, the furthest one over. That's really pretty. I really like that. That reminds me of one of um, a Kat Von D liquid lipstick that I really like. The next one I have is called... Pretty sure they named it after that song. If I am wrong, then that's a big coincidence. But that's that's really pretty. I really like that. Have I done? Have I swatched that one? No. What am I doing? Not even swatching it. Now, how would I describe that? I would describe this one still sort of like um purple, purpley, but like burgundy as well. Oh, that's pretty. Like actually looks like a berry sort of shade on my hand. So that's staying alive. Cute. So cute. And then we have Burning Love, and it is a red, and it looks like a really nice sort of corally red, pinky undertone maybe. Now I'm swatching it, not so much corally, just sort of red. <laughs> but that's it there on the end. So that's all the shades there. So I'm sure most of you guys have heard of Frank Bod's Body Scrubs. I have personally never, ever, ever used them. So it says it's a coffee scrub, but I'm pretty sure I read on my phone, which where did I put my phone, that it's meant to be cake scented or something. The Mecca Beauty Junkies dreamt up this special scrub and Frank made it come true. A coffee scrub that smells like birthday cake. Yep. So there you go. It does smell like birthday cake and it's going to cost 22 Australian dollars or 24 New Zealand dollars. This looks so cute. I actually am really excited to try it because like I said, I've never tried any of their scrubs. I really have like just never use scrubs like ever and I feel like being a fake tanning queen that it's a no-brainer I should have been using scrubs oh my god look how cute the packaging is it's pink you guys know how I feel about pink everything that is so cute so it's vegan made in Australia contains no nuts and it has a waterproof bag. Use me two to three times per week. Leave on for three minutes. You can massage it into your entire body. I'm just gonna have to open it to smell it because I just need to know what it smells like. Oh my God, it smells so good. It literally smells like coffee and birthday cake. So in this box, I do have a little bit of skincare. So this is the Mario Badescu Radiant Skin trio so i've got a glycolic foaming cleanser a rose hip mask and a facial spray with aloe herbs and rose water that looks really really nice oh so that rose hip that's a, that's a mask so it says the cleanser will rejuvenate and retexturize your skin and it's something you should use only one to three times per week so because i get a little bit sensitive to stuff like that that's probably something i could use once a week then i have Facial spray with aloe, herbs, and rose water, which is something you can use all the time. You can use it on bare skin, or you can use it on top of makeup, and it's like hydrating and can give you a dewy radiance. So that's cool. Then the rose hip mask up here, it says it restores healthy, dewy glow to dull, dehydrated skin. Your girl needs that. It's infused with rose hip extract and rose hip oil, both rich in antioxidants, and helps to even out skin tone and soften the appearance of dry lines. Nice. I'm excited to give those a go. I haven't really tried much Mario Badescu skincare. I've only ever tried like their drying lotion, I think, and that's about it. So I'm keen to try those things out. That's such a good little set, and it retails for. It's only fifty-seven dollars. 57 Australian dollars or 62 New Zealand 
dollars. I feel like that's really good value. Let me just open up and see how big these products are. Well, they're full size products, guys. The next things I have to show you, I'm actually going to put into a giveaway for you guys. So if you guys would like a chance to win these few products I'm going to show you next, just check the description box with how you can enter and I'll pick a winner. So it's not heaps, there's not a lot of stuff, it's just that I'm probably not going to use these things and even though I'm so grateful and appreciative to have them, all those things are going to take up so much of my time that I'm probably not going to get a chance to actually use these goodies while they're available in store. So I'd rather give them to one of you guys and you guys, you know, can share in the excitement with me. So check the description box of how you can enter to win these next. How many products? We've got one, two, three, four, five, six. We've got six things six things in total. So the first thing I have is the Winky Lux Anniversary Kit. Now the reason I'm giving away this anniversary kit is because Mecca has already very kindly sent me a whole box of Winky Lux. I don't know if you guys have seen these lipsticks online, but they have the beautiful flower in them and I believe they're like they're like adjusting lip products, so they don't look like anything. When you put them on, they give your lips like a really nice tint. So it says it applies clear, then quickly reacts to your skin's pH level. So it's one of those lip products that react to your pH level. So you've got one of those, and then you've also got a peachy nude liquid lipstick. And it's whipped with real vanilla and avocado oil. Ooh. So that retails for 40 Australian dollars. Now the next thing I have are a bunch of the NARS lipsticks. I've got four different shades. Um, they are the Audacious Lip not liquid lipsticks, they're just normal lipsticks, but they're the Audacious lipsticks, and I have four colours in here to give to one of you lucky people. The first one is called Isabella. I'll take it out and I'll show you. This is, oh, they're so pretty. I hope one of you guys will really love these. They, they aren't exactly my sort of colors. So if you're a dark lip lover, then definitely make sure you check the description box and enter because you'll love these. So that is the first one. It's like it's like a burgundy chocolate color and the packaging is just so luxurious and beautiful. And this next shade is called Delphine. Delphine. I know I'm not saying that right. It's D-E-L-P-H-I-N-E. -E. I don't know, I'm not pronouncing that right, but anywho, what really matters is what the color is. And this one is like sort of another like a burgundy deep brown shade. I don't really know how to describe that. It's a little bit more chocolatey and less sort of ready, if that makes sense. Then we've got Margot and it is like a red. It's still like a brown red. I feel like all these shades are like brownish, reddish colors. Reddish, but they look really pretty. And then lastly, we have this shade, which is called Bella and it is more of just a straight brownie nude. This is really, really beautiful. Really gorgeous for like every day. Oh, such a gorgeous shade. So they're the four NARS lipsticks. Full price for each lipstick, they're 46 Australian dollars or 51 New Zealand dollars. So there's $200 worth of lipsticks right there. So although it's not a big giveaway, when you think about how much it costs if you had to buy these yourself, it's still like, it's still worth a lot because it's high end makeup. So the next thing I have is this gorgeous Too Faced and Mecca palette and it is so beautiful. The packaging is just adorable and it's filled with really gorgeous neutral shades. Now the reason I'm going to give this away is just because I have a bazillion Too Faced palettes and I also have a bazillion neutral palettes. So I just, I just really try not to be wasteful with product and you may see like I might take a picture of this just so I can post it on my Instagram but I'm going to give it away to someone instead who I know you know, probably doesn't have as many palettes as I have and might give it a little bit more love than what I would. So that is it there. It looks so pretty, so cute and like the actual um, packaging. It looks like it's like icing with sprinkles. That's how I would say, like what I would say the actual box looks like, so cute. Retails for 57 Australian dollars or 62 New Zealand dollars. So there is about $300 worth of product in this little box. So like I said, if you guys would like a chance to win the goodies that you see right here, those six products, then just check my description box for how you need to enter. And yeah, 
Hope you guys are excited. I know it's not a ginormous giveaway, but it's this little something something. So that is everything I very kindly received. And just Mecca, thank you so much for always spoiling me absolutely rotten. And a massive happy birthday to you guys. I think everything is so beautiful. And all the brands you collaborated with have done such an incredible job. And I'm just so excited to actually see everything else in store. Now I'm going to go ahead and take my lashes off and have a little rest because my eyes are really sore and now my throat hurts from talking so much. So also don't forget to check the description box to enter that little giveaway and thank you so very much for watching. If you've made it all the way to the end, you guys already know it's a thing now. If you make it to the end, you're my MVPs and you know how much you mean to me and I love and appreciate you. So thank you so very much for watching. Don't forget to thumbs it up for me if you enjoyed the video. Leave me some comments and subscribe before you leave and I'll be talking to you all really soon. Bye.